Cube, car. Asking Flappa. Cube, car. Asking Flappa. Here's a quick rundown on the Floppa Cubes. This has got this 3D printed case with just some paper on top of it. I don't remember exactly who uh, designed the cubes themselves, but if I fig do figure it out, I'll post it in the description. On the back here, we have the uh, USB port, and then it starts blinking rapidly, and that means it's uh, announcing its presence on the network, uh, connecting to a server which uh, talks to the Google Assistant, and then forwards that to the Floppa. The case itself is just friction fit, so you can just pull it out. And it's using this uh, custom circuit board I built. And uh, the top is literally just a box. And the heart of the bit that makes the cube go car is uh, this uh, vibration motor, which is the same that they use in a PS2, PS3 maybe. Uh, I just ordered an entire bag of these from, from AliExpress. And then it's using this uh, 3D printed clamp just to hold it in place. And then this is also just friction fits. You can just pull that out. I did make a few mistakes while making this, such as uh, not using enough capacitance, so I had to bodge on a much larger capacitor for the vibration motor, plus a second large one just for the ESP. The ESP here is the uh, microcontroller, and that has built-in Wi-Fi, which uh, controls the motor down here, which is just done through a simple uh, MOSFET and uh, diode. So then I've got power and programming coming in through the USB, I just have a little bit of ESD protection, and then a voltage regulator, just an LDO, which provides uh, the 3.3 volts to the microcontroller. And then I'm just using a cheap uh, CH340C, which is this chip here, which is to uh, make it so you can communicate between USB and the microcontroller and program it directly with USB. Uh, I got the four little uh, SMD diodes, the ones that light up red and make the flop uh, light uh, red when it's uh, doing the car thing. And then I got the, some debug buttons and some debug header. If there's interest, I can always put the uh, schematics in the description. But anyway, that's the useless flopper cubes.